Pokemon, and you're joining me on part 21. Click the bottom annotation, which will take you back to part 20 if you happen to miss it, or click the top annotation, which will take you back all the way to part 1, if for whatever reason you're joining me in the middle of this and need to start over from there. For those of you who are where you should be, I have two notes that I want to make a mention of. The first being that I did not, in fact, go through Fred and Edgar's mind like I'd mentioned in part 20 simply because there were things that happened, and I just haven't gotten around to it now. It's also been a very long time since I've recorded one, due to the next note that I have to mention, which is, I've recorded part 21 already before. However, I was used to my old microphone that I had, which, there's a little switch on the microphones, both of them, that one way that I flip it, the microphone is on, the other way, it's off. Well they're backwards from the two microphones, so I had it flipped the wrong way, the entire episode didn't notice it, and then had an episode that had no audio to it, or at least none of my speaking to it. So I had to redo the entirety of part 20 in, you know, a different playthrough. I actually got to gather a few more things that I didn't gather the first time, so it's less to grab later on when I go through it, but instead I'm actually going to go through here, through the asylum, um, and from there, I'm going to hopefully try to grab everything that's here. Um, I did succeed in grabbing all the brains and all the, uh, uh, what is it, cards and the challenge marker that's here. I managed to grab all that. But I was proud, because I was able to actually grab every one of them the first time I went through this. And... Now I just gotta do it again. Benny. <laughs> they thought it would be smaller. And I just started my stopwatch, the thing that I usually can forget to do, so hopefully that'll help me later on. Um, only problem being that I don't wait remember where they all are. So even though I went through and grabbed them all. Yeah. Ah! Expect you want to come up behind me. Oh, I hate doing this level. It also doesn't help that I have to deal with having a mouse that's smaller. Um because I'm actually, in fact, moving something I've mentioned on my Facebook page, uh, which, if you haven't quite seen yet, there is a link to it in the description. Oh, um, if you, at least if you haven't heard about it, there's a link to it in my description, and you can always go there and like it and be reminded there of anything, or just subscribe to the channel and you'll get all notifications that way as well. Um, but, I made a mention on my Facebook page stating that I hadn't released any videos in a while because I had packed a mouse, and then I finally found one in one of those boxes. It's just not the one that I'm used to, so it's a smaller mouse, which means it's just different. I can't remember... Oh yeah, I remember getting mad at this one. Simply because they threw the little things in there, like that, where there wasn't actually anything in the room. And they're just there to make you think that it is. I'm like, really? Waste my time. Bobby Zilch? I didn't know you had a brain. <laughs> Man, I wish you were here for that joke, Bobby. I 
challenge markers, so I'm not worried about forgetting that. But I can't remember where all the brains were. I don't remember where all the cards were either. In fact, there's two Ah, hello. Cards right in a row like that is kind of funny. Yeah, fire is the only way to get rid of those. At least the only way to get rid of those without get, having to worry about confusion or getting hurt. Oh, darn it. Hey! Hey! Ah! Maybe I should let JT have some time alone before I return this brain. Hello. Oh, as I fell. Oh, god dang it. Um, but I will end up- I'm gonna complete the entirety of this- the upper floor of this asylum. If I can ever get through this jumping puzzle. Which I'll admit took me some time the first time I did this, and then the second time when I had no audio. First time being when I completed it already. Ow, you jerk. So do stupid things like that. Just hold on, and then it would drop me off. Wah. Again, also trying to still get used to this mouse. It is smaller, and my hand's not small enough for it. But, it's what I've got, so I'm gonna have to make do with what I've got. Alright, that was something over there. I think it was just funny as the powers change every time. Wait. 
Explosion of rats. I think the last time I just sat there with my shield on. I was just like, alright, I'm gonna be confused, but at least I won't get any damage. So, I don't know if people remember this or not. From all the way back in, uh, when we got the levitation spell, it was told to elements like these along with, like, fire and electricity, never hurt us. This is the only spot that I've seen this used outside of that, uh, mine. Which goes to show, they put that little thing in, and then didn't use it. sick anymore, so there's, there's good news, that I've gotten over the sickness that I have, so I can actually talk without feeling like I would just sound absolutely horrible. Ah, missed it again. Look at that brain, it's really be fine. Oh, god. Maybe. Maybe. Brain again. Now, with that in mind, I'm gonna take a look. There we go. So I've got five more cards, five more brains. Which. Oh, right, I remember now. Never mind, never mind. I'm not gonna ruin it. There's still another smallish ish 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 area that the other brains are at. Along with the cutscene to go with that. Yeah. Oh, really? I can't even get back up to where I need to go. Yeah. yeah, if things really messed up with this one for whatever reason, I do still have it saved after my last one, where I started going through uh, Fred's mind again, I would just prefer not using it simply because I'd rather do where I'm at now instead. Oh, they're coming behind me, I think. I told you I'd get your brain back. This was the brain that I missed in the last one. I think there was another one. 
That's not what I want to do. There was another brain that I missed in my original, original playthrough. Um, but this is the one that... Or one that I remember anyway, that I missed in the first one that I played. Which I suppose I could technically go back and get it at this point, but it's not worth it considering where I'm at. Uh, let me make sure I didn't leave any other things behind. No, I don't believe so. Ah! Yeah. No. Oh, well, that's not there. Go down here. Huh. Phoebe's brain is warmer than the others. brains to go and two cards to go. I believe the challenge marker's coming up. Like I said, I know where it is, but as far as like in relevance to the remainder of the level, I don't. Oh, okay. Ah! Well, I guess that answered that question that I had earlier on if I could actually fall through the level or fall off the level like that. And I've just proved that these things aren't just astral projection layers. Oh god. Now, because I just lost one, but I'm not in someone's mind. So, ha, game, ha, I win. Not really, you still win, because you still get to make your rules. And I still have to be the one here. There's the challenge marker. I knew where it was. Ish. Okay. This is another fun part, though. Rats. Rats everywhere. Me, I'm just gonna sit right there. my health will very, very, very slowly regenerate. You might see it a bit. 
bunch of copper inside. Let's see if I can Brain. Three cheers for brains! <laughs> now, one thing I believe I did warn you once before, at least I vaguely remember having said it. Before I say that, we... One brain, one card, okay. Um, but yeah, one thing I vaguely remember having said in uh, one of my playthroughs. I can't remember which one off the top of my head, but I remember saying it anyway. Uh, there it is. Yep. Was that. Was that I was gonna be spending a lot of extra time in the very last mine? trying to grab all the figments and everything so I can have that 100% playthrough. And voila! To think that every cell in Mill's brain is dedicated to the ladies. There we go. Now you can go see this. This is your last warning! Go back down right now or you'll be It doesn't really explain much, but you'll see as we go along. Maybe. <laughs> On the right side, I don't have to deal with any more rats. No, that's not what I want that one. Because, when you come up here, the bird sees me and moves me down the ramp. Something as small as Vernon's brain holds so many boring stories. But we love Vernon, because he's Vernon. And his stories sometimes make us laugh. Right? Right? Sure. Worthless! These brains are worthless, Shigo! <laughs> Just like the one in your head! No, no, they're nice! They're too nice! They won't fight! I need killers! I need angry brains! I squeeze them! I poke them! I twist them! What do I have to do to make them fight? Maybe I should try my drill. I'm not gonna bring you any more brains if you're gonna be so mean to them! No matter what I do? No, no matter what? Not even if I... No, oh, not even if I no, cook you a little... A little turtle soup? Please, Dr. Lobato, no! Hmm, a nice hot turtle soup, hmm? No! Nothing better on a cold night like this than some boiling hot soup. You leave Mr. Pokey alone! Oh, okay. <laughs> you sure? No! I mean, yes! <laughs> all right, all right. Oh, why don't I just go ahead and heat you up a cup? It's made of turtles! Turtles that you love! Isn't that right, Mr. Foggy Low? Okay, okay. Well, maybe I'll just make some for myself. Bring me a good brain, Shigo! 
Uh, Mr. Pokey Loop becomes Mr. Smokey Loop. <laughs> Smokey Loop. <laughs> when you're a dentist, you have to learn to have a sense of humor, you know. It helps to calm the patients down. I didn't have the audio going, I wondered, why am I one card short of making a, uh, or one card more than the cards that I can use to make a, um, a challenge marker? And then I remembered, uh, these, the mental cobwebs, and then it all explained everything. So, now we have all these brains to return, we've grabbed every single brain, and I will do that in the next episode when I show you everything I've gotten. Um, as you did see before, when I get to rank 95, it will give me, um, infinite ammo, which is always nice. Um, but I'm gonna make sure I try to grab everything, and I don't think I might, I might not make it to that. If I do, it would be mainly on figments alone, but I, I, maybe, I don't know. Um, but then I'll go through, I'll buy as many side challenge markers as I need, or side cores, anyway, as I need. Um, I've only got eight more pieces of emotional baggage, two more vaults to crack. Um, so yeah, once I get all the cobwebs, I'll make sure I have all the side cores I need, and I'll uh, look ahead and see how many cobwebs that will be in the last one, so I know that I have an extra one for that, because I think it'll only be enough to make one, and you'll see something in the last mine that'll still let me turn that in. Um, so I will go back and I will do Fred and Edgar's, Edgar's mind, wow, I couldn't talk today. Um, I am in the process of moving, so the next video probably won't be up for a little while, because for about the next five days I'll be in the process of driving across the country, and that's just not going to work very well. Um, so after that, then you will see what I've done with Fred and Edgar's mind, as well as where we are here in Psychonauts. We'll turn in all the brains, all the cobwebs, and make as many challenge markers as we can, and get as close as we can to a full... 100% completion prior to going to that point of no return. So thank you all so much for watching me this time, and sorry that it took so long for me to get another video out, and I hope that you all join me next time on Psychonauts.